One. Power up. We're in the autonomous period. All robots seem to be on the move. The red owns their switch. Buchanan Bird brings out a power cube with their switch. So everybody gets a ranking point for the auto run. Nobody touched the scale during the autonomous, so we'll step, see what happens. 1323, quickly Madtown adds a power cube to the scale. The red owns the scale now. 1671, Bird Brain's trying to pick up a power cube, brings it over in, into their zone. They lift up and they put a power cube onto the scale. But they've got a ways to catch up because Madtown for the Red Alliance is really piling up the auto, the uh, power cubes onto their side of the scale. 3859 for the Blue Alliance, grabbing power cubes from their power cube zone and putting them into the exchange so that their human players can add them to the vault. Red Alliance already own, uh, powering up the levitation. So they're gonna go for that 30 points and probably a fourth ranking point if they can face the boss at the end of the match. Seventy fifty-seven. those rookies, those Titanators grabbing a power cube. Looks like they're having trouble driving in a straight line. Maybe a driving issue. Bird brains for the Blue Alliance grabbing power cubes and adding them, trying to, trying to add, trying to neutralize the red switch. They got a ways to go though. They got a power up. Both, both sides have levitated. We'll see how it goes. We got 30 seconds. We're into the end game now. 13.23 for the Red Alliance to place their Ramp, we'll see if 5419 for the red can get on board. I don't think they can do it. Well, they keep jamming up against that ramp. In the meantime, the bird brains are trying to climb up and get, and they do climb. Can 3859 climb as well? They might get two robots to climb. I don't think they're gonna make it. And that's the end of the match. Pretty exciting. The Red Alliance takes the victory and escapes the arcade with 444 points. Three ranking points. So the Blues 173, but they do get 